Hi there guys for new stocking and one more easy trail video for you. Um, in this easy trail video I am going to help you uh, to fix your locks that is caused by the CPU uh, throttling. So some information about it. The command that will help you to detect is the CPU of the problem and uh, some good advice how it could be fixed. So the dynamic frequency scaling uh, is most known as the CPU throttling is a thing uh, that or maybe technique of the CPU frequency <coughs> automatic adjustment. So in most cases it's used to reduce the amount of heat generated by the chip. How to detect is it the reason of your CPU lock. Uh, like maybe two years ago, the developers had a good command, uh, such called CPU frequency monitoring command. CPU frequency monitoring, set it to one. Also, don't forget to use the CL show FPS command or net graph. Uh, in other cases, you will not uh, see how it's working, only in the console, like this, but not in the game. As you can see at the bottom of the graph, I have that command enable. So that command <coughs> uh, is used to see if CPU thermal throttling is an issue. So if the displayable CPU frequency percentage, the displayable CPU frequency percentage like the second column, this uh, drops below like 80%, uh, then you may have a problem with your CPU slowing down due to overheating. If it drops below 50%, then you may have a serious problem and you can like burn your CPU. So, CPU overheating can be caused by overclocking, insufficient coolant, insufficient airflow, uh, dirty fans, or other causes. In most cases, the main reason is the bad thermal interface. So, the thermal interface is uh, the stuff that is located between the chip surface, so the source of the heat, your CPU, and the heatsink surface. So. Try to replace it. Find some good tests of different thermal interfaces. And uh, if you don't know how to, ask someone to replace it for you. Uh, buy the best one from the best of, uh, manufacturers of it. And in most cases it will fix your problems. Also clear your uh, cooling system. And I think it will help. So thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to thumb up, subscribe to my channel. And wait for more good videos about CSGO. And other source based, source engine based games.